I love my base. The security is top notch. I couldn't imagine anybody getting in. That base was terrible. I tried building another 30,000 blocks away from spawn, but I felt lonely. My dignity was in shambles. So right then, I decided to live in spawn. <laughs> That spawned? Why would I want to live there? In spawn, okay. But if I couldn't even make a secure base 700 blocks away, how was I going to build one right at spawn? Well, by using... The first step to any bunker is the secret entrance. I can pick from a multitude of secret entrances. Like this, like this, like this, like this, or even like this. But instead, we're gonna be going with chat GPT. What secret redstone entrance should I build to my Minecraft bunker? To build one, you can use a combination of redstone torches, levers, pistons. Here's a simple tutorial. Wait, wait, he's giving me a tutorial? <laughs> what? He's giving me a tutorial? Wait, it just says a hidden door, but what hidden door is it? Two by two? A one by two? Three by three? Is it flush? Is it seamless? You can also hide the lever by placing it on a nearby wall or behind a piece of furniture. Wow. What? Let's follow the tutorial and see if it if this actually works. Dig a hole in the wall of your bunker. Place a piston on one side of the hole. Piston? What? Okay, wait a minute, wait a minute. Revealing this intro. Okay, I have no idea. This is this is totally not working. Okay, so it says dig a hole like this, place a piston on one side, a redstone torch on the other side, connect both of them with a piece of redstone dust, and power it with a lever. Well, last time I checked, this is not a secret entrance. Maybe, like, ask it more generic questions. Okay, bookshelf door. Okay, pressure plate door. Piston door. Of course, all of these are going to be piston doors, bro. Hidden lever door. <laughs> okay, I'm definitely saying that the pressure plate door is probably the worst one, and that's why we're 100% doing it. <laughs> we're going to be using a pressure plate to activate our secret Minecraft bunker. And that is a pulse extender done. So, power this pressure plate. The door opens up for a long period of time and then closes right afterwards. This is really, this is really bad. With a little more help from chat gpt we were able to build a rustic interior okay i'm not gonna lie but this looks actually really sick because of the atrocious first secret entrance i decided to give chat gpt one more chance to build a second secret entrance inside of the bunker we just have to hope that this time it's actually secret before activated secret entrance can be created in minecraft by a simple tutorial place pressure plates on the Again with the pressure plates, bro. You're killing me here, bro. Despite once again an awful design, I deciphered that ChatGPT wanted us to build this. A thing that pushes blocks back and forth. This creates a tiny hole briefly, which you can smash your entire body down, destroying your beautiful face. Although there was a problem. We just need a way to get back up. And of course, ChatGPT did not even include this in the tutorial, so we had to improvise. I'm thinking about a slime block launcher. I think a slime block launcher would be sick. We're actually gonna place a hopper right here. Now, if I stay on this slime block, hopefully this works. Press the button. I should get launched up. And okay, maybe it's just too fast. Hopefully this works. So if I press this button. Oh my gosh, that's perfect. Did you see that? That's so satisfying. It's safe to say that it actually works. Okay, so if we run up to this pressure plate, activate it, we should open up this and we can fall down into our next level bunker. Now this is the actual site of the bunk i just broke redstone the second thing you need in a bunker is um uh, i actually don't know so let's ask chat gpt food and water beds lighting okay power outages power outage in minecraft traps for intruders what dude it's giving me so much stuff to build medical supplies okay i don't really know how we can use that one. First thing is first is we need a bunch of food and water okay done we're stockpile of food uh that was kind of easy beds done luxury beds with no head space i'm really feeling bad for this guy lighting oh yeah shoot this is what it looks like bro if i was living in here for like 25 years i would probably cry and lighting is completely finished this is pretty cozy i'm not gonna lie entertainment what books oh it doesn't say an enchanting table it literally just says a bookshelf i guess we're not building an enchanting table and musical instrument and now we have the musical number it's raining it's on this SMP. Although, if you lived in this bunker currently, you would starve to death. What if I run out of food and water in my bunker? Starve. No, I'm just kidding. It, it didn't say that. It said farming. So I'm thinking that we have like a little bit of melon farm action right here. You know, I seriously doubt this is going to actually be useful on lifesteal. Oh, shoot. Look at that. And it produces melons. And then it goes into this hopper, which you can access from this chest. Oh my gosh. This is actually sick. ChatGPT said a great bunker also should have security systems. Right now, we have no security systems. Also, we don't have a storage system. So I'm going to be combining both of them into one. And that's why we're going to be making a vault. All of the pistons will extend. And then all we have to do is just flick this lever.
Um, yeah, so it's definitely not that easy. We should have the entire thing working with a little bit more redstone. So if we go ahead and flick this lever, as you can see, everything gets pulled back down into the ground. So this is our vault, which is super sick. So we should be housing all of our precious resources behind it. Looking in hindsight, the use of sand is probably not the best way to hide a vault. Nobody's gonna probably find it on life steal anyway, so it's not that big of a deal. Yo, this vault is actually looking sick. Uh, but right now we have no way of actually activating it or getting inside of this vault so now we need the key card activation system Basically, we're gonna like throw an item into this corner. It's gonna get picked up by a hopper minecart and then trigger the door. Check this out, check this out. So the bottom dropper is completely empty. And with this little circuit, if we throw a paper onto this block, this redstone torch will flash going through this system. It'll check, is it one of these? And then it'll end up into this dropper, which is now full. Boom. Oh my gosh, I'm really gonna have a heart attack. And with a little more redstone, I was able to hook up the key card detection system with the door. But if you throw the correct key card in, you should see the door. Oh my gosh, and the key card gets spit out. This is insane. And for a little more protection, I made a bubble column that got me out of harm's way. I also placed a bunch of extra key cards underneath this cauldron. This is gonna be important later. But there was still one more thing I had to do. What can I build to protect myself? Floor traps, air dispensers, or falling sand traps to deter incapacitate intrusion. bunker could evade some of the smartest minds on the life steal SP. Probably can't because it's using pressure plates. So Rec Rap Vortex spoke Parrot and Yeah Jaren are all on vacation, so they're doing it from Parrot's laptop. I don't use hacks. Yo, right there, Barrett. Oh my gosh, that tree looks so suspicious. A pressure plate activates our first secret entrance that's located in this room. So as long as they don't walk in here, we should be fine. It's somewhere around spawn. So the radius from like here? Yeah. From 100, yeah. Like 100? Actually. I'm doing find the button. All right, target acquired. Okay, uh, all right, uh, all right. Yeah, there's gonna be a button there. right on the other side. Oh, we got scammed. Okay, all right. I feel like a strat here might be to just like go around the radius. Okay, I want to see this check this thing out first. Uh, let's see. Maybe what if it, it, might, it could just be here? You know, you true, never know. True, you never know. <laughs> Is that it? <laughs> I don't know if he ever actually used this place or if it was just a little cool thing you made. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh, right there. The bunker! No way! We found no it! No way! We found the bunker! In here? I don't know why it would. Oh! oh! Yo! So yo! <laughs> find it immediately? <laughs> That's what also happened with terrain. Did I find it? <laughs> <laughs> I find that it? was quick. Oh no, ChatGPT is not. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> okay, okay. Fair, 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 fair. Is this the actual Broken bunker, map. though? He's asking if this is the actual bunker. Oh, a bunker in a bunker. <laughs> this trap chest. No, these are all regular, I think. Yeah. Uh, nothing in the furnaces. A ChatGPT. I feel like AI, like, AI typically thinks very, like, structurally, very black and white. While humans are very colorful and quirky. Oh, but there could be comparators. But there, there could be a, what is it called? Why is there one plank wait, wait, in the wait, wait, furnace? Try to, try to cook well, I mean, is that the rest of the bunker? I mean, is it? Like, I don't know. I mean, I don't know. I mean, there could be something else, I suppose. Well, what could that something else be? Well, I found a pressure plate okay. here. <laughs> oh. Oh. Where was that? Hold on. Oh, 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 oh. my God. The entire floor just shifted. Oh, oh you oh got God. it. No way. Uh, Yo, okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, wait, wait, you're right. What's that? There's a pressure plate. Go, 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 go. Yo! Reddins, welcome to uh, the actual bunker. You might notice that we don't have a storage system. Ooh. So, if you can find the key card that accesses the storage system, I'll let you open it. Oh, the key card. It's not under a bed. Why is there just a wall of gravel? Wait, did is you that aesthetics or does it falling? drop down? Uh, so, I can't break blocks? No. But it's somewhere in this area. Well, I assume it's not bread. Yeah, it's uh, not. It's not gonna be bread or pumpkin pie. No, I'm just... no way. Hold on. Oh wow, that's smart. Yo, yep. okay, that's... you are so close. I am so close. Huh? <laughs> Cube, you are messing with a. 
Oh, 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 yo, let's go. Yo, yo, wait, what's this? Hey, so you are so close right now. I'm not even gonna. Oh, lie. there we go. Let's go. Uh, uh, after showing them the vault, yo, yo. Oh. oh, shit. All right. No, that was that was completely incorrect. I'm beast straight. I was never good with like you know throwing. Boom! <laughs> I knew it was behind the gravel. Yeah, yeah. It was finally time to test the security systems. You are technically an intruder in my bunker. He said we're an intruder. Oh. Uh oh. Okay. Uh -oh. You are technically an intruder. Uh. So I'm gonna give you two seconds to escape. Two seconds to escape <laughs> the bunker. <laughs> Run! Oh my God! Oh, <laughs> oh my God! What a, what a... Uh, <laughs> oh, <I'm running. laughs> no, he bubbled the elevator. Wait, throw something on the pressure Let's plate. Let's go! No, it's, it's really funny that I just wasn't even standing in the right area. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> what I just, what I, what I just get out? That was so fast. You escaped so fast. I just wore that. Although the trap really didn't work, it gave me ample time to escape through the bubble column, and in most cases, the intruder was trapped on the complete opposite side of the room. The bunker was flawed in many, many ways. Although, it did pull through in the end by getting me out of harm's way or did it can we do one last final freestyle rap for you bro we're pulling up to the tub gotta get my food get it from grub hub because you know that we got it just grub pulling up gotta eat all the chug hey now i'm doing parkour in the hub yeah better go